<laughs> the only thing, like, like, Alright. <laughs> hey. Hey, hey, hey. I learned a lot watching that set. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna perform next set. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my floor. I learned a lot. Yeah, he done got the set of I like it. The N word and black pepper are the exact same thing. Huh? I didn't know that before. <laughs> <laughs> they both have the same usage, and they both make your mouth taste good. Uh, I'm I'm treading thin water. That's why I even calling back to that. But I did like how you like berated women for half your set, and the only one here to defend them is Lori. Gladys <laughs> was even here. She no, she walked out in the middle of it. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> this is like the gentleman's club to the max. <laughs> you can say whatever you want tonight, but make sure Lori's not in the room. Alright, we're going to keep the show rolling. This next comedian coming to the stage may or may not be a misogynist. I don't know. But we're about to find out. Ladies and gentlemen, clap your hands for Hakeem Coons. <laughs> Sasha and Malia. It's real talk. It's Sasha and Malia. So, you know, I, I get there. I'm trying to, you know, trying to blend in into the, you know, she do me a favor by letting me stay there for a little while. And my little girls, you know, they come up to me and ask me stuff, but they call me Fake Phil. Fake Phil. They're not calling me Daddy, they call me Fake Phil. So obviously I go to the mother, I said, why are my children? Call me fake Phil. And she says, Well, you look like a fake season one, no beard having Uncle Phil that got kicked out of Bel Air. <laughs> so you a fake Phil. Don't have my girls call me that. Please, please. Okay, I'm trying to get along with you. All right. So then I get a call while I'm at the house that my girls are bullying me. Other little girls. So, you know, they come home and I says, Y'all can't, you can't, you can't. You know, you can't bully other little girls, princesses. They said, yes, we can. I said, uh, no, you can't. They said, Trump said we could. I said, you can't, you can't listen to Trump. You know, Trump is the bad guy. Trump is Cobra Commander. <laughs> Trump is Zartan. <laughs> Trump is, uh, let me see if I can put, help you out. It's Nimigrad. Lemon grass. <laughs> a few people know who that is. They said, Lemon grass from Adventure Time? I said, yes, him. Except he's more like orange grass. Because he's orange. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I got it. I got yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I tried to go to sleep in an apartment. And of course, uh, uh, aggravating a woman like my um, baby's mother, sort of like Beth Miller. And um, ruthless people has a stupid ass Shih Tzu little dog that goes around the apartment and does everything it can to give me, you know, living hell. So I, I put my nice little ACG boots. Now you know us black people, we cherish ACG boots from nice. All right, they better than Timberlands. Don't fuck with my ACGs. You know what I'm saying? So I put them. Yeah, yeah, they love them, man. I put them. <laughs> I put him next to my, you know, my bed, and all of a sudden I'm waking up and I hear some, some, some something's pissing or, or peeing in my boots. 
So I go to the mother and I say, why is your dog peeing in my boots? Well, you should never put your boots on his pee pad. I said, everybody else walks their dog. I ain't got to walk a dog. It's a shih tzu. That's why I got it, so I didn't have to walk it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's good. I, I like the imitation I do like that. <laughs> so my kids walk up to me and they pat me on the stomach. Uh -huh. And they said, Daddy, is it true your stomach's full of shit? Oh. <laughs> Mama said you full of shit. <laughs> and I said, I was that old too. I said, why are you telling my kids this is not fat, this is shit? <laughs> she said, because you are full of shit, because you think you're so smart and you think you're so funny, which you're not. Wow. Yeah. Wow, and that's why I had to exit the house and go to my, you know, well, you know what we do when we leave one woman, we go to our other woman's house and go to them as brothers, right? You know that, right? I got you. So, <laughs> she, unfortunately, has, you know, she lives in the projects not too far from the village, so I, I, I have to walk through the village in order to get to her house, you know? So when I go through the village, they don't, you know, when they see me, they don't say, yo, what's up, big man? Yo, big man, like you probably call me, yo, big man, what's up? You know what I'm saying? They, uh, they say, hey, bear. Bear. What's up, bear? Right? I know if you was gay, you call me bear, I'm sure. You're not gay, bro. So, <laughs> so, you know, I'm walking through the village. I'm trying to make it to my girl house so I can, you know, put my stuff there and, and move in, you know, from coming from my baby mama house. And then um, all the, you know, the gay person that was there, they're, you know, holding hands, and then they, when they pass me, they're doing a choking sign. <coughs> they're doing a choking sign towards me, you know? And I'm trying to figure out why are you doing the choking sign. So unbeknownst known to me, I find out that they're trying to say that their partner is well endowed. And they're and they bragging to, to me that their partner is well endowed. And since there's no women in here, I said, baby, it's for you. I'm sorry. I thought this was the gentleman's class. I was going to ask, do you do that for your partner? Do what? <laughs> 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 Ladies and gentlemen, that's my time. <laughs> I gotta go get her a chastise on. Give it up for Hakeem, ladies and gentlemen. Hakeem Boone. I wanna know who's the guy who had to evict him? Who's the guy who had to go up to him and tell him? You can't be where you are right now. Because I would hate that job. I'm trying to move you. It makes me look small. All right, ladies and gentlemen.